you have your lawnmower? <laughs> Do you have your slide? Ready. Ready. Yeah. Set. Go. Go. I love how he wears his hat sideways, you guys. It just makes my day. The ball. Where's your ball? <gasps> Yay! Bounce, bounce. Bounce, bounce. It's, a, it's actually deflating a, a little bit. A. a. It's far? A. a. Airport? Is that what you said? B. B. Ball. Ball. Hi, guys. I would say good morning, except it's afternoon. I keep telling... Can you find your car? I keep telling myself like I should vlog and then I haven't been doing it and now I decided okay I will. It is unseasonably warm today. It is currently like 77 out. Yeah get in the car. It's currently 77 out and it is October 7th so that is crazy. Usually October is like cold and it has been chilly up until today. Like it's been 60s and stuff but right now it's like 70 seven like i said super warm breezy like this is the most beautiful day i wish it was always like this weather it's so nice that as soon as anthony's off of work which it will be in a couple of minutes we're going to go on a walk and walk around our neighborhood um there's an elementary school in our neighborhood i think i've talked about this before but i'll talk about it again there's an elementary school which if we're still in this house when gray goes to school which we probably won't be because we're putting our house on the market but if we did that would be the elementary school that Gray went to. And it has two um, parks, two playgrounds, I guess I should say, in it. It has like a little playground for little kids and then like a bigger playground for older kids. I'm assuming they do like K through four, I think there. Um, and Gray loves both of the playgrounds. So we usually stop there during our walk and let Gray play on the playground before we had porter we were both able to go on the playground and like help him and watch him and things like that but now that we have porter i usually like to just keep him in the stroller because he's in his car seat so we keep him in there and anthony usually goes and plays with with grayson and then i'll stick back with porter or vice versa so it's kind of different but we definitely need to go on a walk because it is just beautiful out and really it's like today's gonna be the only warm day i mean like tomorrow's supposed to be like 68 so like still warm but not as warm and then friday i think is supposed to be like low 70s but then it's supposed to rain all weekend and get really cold i know i don't know if you guys really care about the weather but i'm super into the weather i should be like a weather man weather woman i don't know which what do you call because it's isn't it like the weatherman that's what you call it the news thing what do you call girls girl weathermen girl girl I don't know <laughs> I'm going on this tangent do you guys even care so anyway I'll get some footage at the park hopefully or the playground I don't know why I keep calling it a park I will get some footage at the playground I am all over the place um <laughs> but guys look at our backyard there are more and more leaves if you saw my previous vlog you'll hear about how I'm dreading all of these leaves falling because that means we're gonna have to rake them all up but I think we're gonna get a leaf blower this year so hopefully that will help the only thing that's nice about all these leaves falling is I will I am planning on raking them all up and putting Grayson in them and maybe Porter too getting some pictures um, but that's the only thing they're good for I hate raking them and bagging them and Grayson's always singing something you guys, he just seems so big to me now. Now that I've had Porter, he just seems like a kid. Like, before I had Porter, he was a toddler, and now he's like a kid. Like, in a couple months in January, I'm going to be signing him up for preschool. Preschool, you guys. I don't know if this is how it is in all of the states or cities or whatever, but in Columbus, um, a lot of the preschools start their enrollment for next year for preschool in January. Early January, which just seems like 
crazy to me that I'm going to be signing him up for preschool next year. Preschool is optional, but they have, at least where I'm at, they have a three-year-old preschool and a four-year-old preschool, and then he would go to kindergarten at age five. So I went to preschool for two years, and so I'm going to put Grayson in school for two years. I think he's going to do awesome. He already knows like all of his letters, all of his numbers. Um, I'm fixing a toy, if that's what you're wondering what I'm doing. But yeah, he knows all of that stuff. Um, the thing I think he could gain from preschool is learning social cues and how to interact with classmates because especially with COVID, we don't interact with a lot of kids his age. He doesn't have any cousins. Um, all he has really is Porter and he doesn't interact with Porter. So I think that would be good. And also just learning like, you know, putting your hand up to ask a question and sitting at your desk and you know, lining up and listening to the teachers. So I think that will be good for him. And I'm just so excited for him to start school and learn. He's just wanting to learn so much and he learns something new every day, I swear. And his vocabulary is just expanding and he's gonna be two and a half on in a couple days. And it's just crazy that he's getting so big. Where did my baby go? Spin around. Spin around, okay, ready? You guys, my kid is a daredevil. He does not get this from me, but I cannot wait until he's big enough to go on like roller coasters because he's gonna love them. He constantly has to be spun around in his crib. Ready? That? Go! <laughs> he is crazy. Hi, made it to the playground and it's dead. We're the only ones here. <laughs> and Anthony is with Porter. Right there. There's our new double stroller. It's heavy and huge, <laughs> but it works. You gonna go down the slide? What's that? What's that? What's that? So yeah, like I was talking about earlier, this is the school and this is the kid, like the little kid playground. And then just on the other side of the building is the big playground. Planets. Maze. Maze. Music. Music. Music, yeah. <laughs> Just go stare at it. Boarding. You're pumping your legs. Pump, 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 pump. Pump, pump, pump. Grayson is watching Puppy Dog Pals, his new favorite show. He always asks, Puppy Pals, Puppy Dogs, Puppy Dogs. And Porter and I are working some gas bubbles out, or I hope. So it's the next day. I only filmed that little bit at the park. And then Gray really didn't play that long. And Porter got hungry, so I had to feed him on a random bench. <laughs> And yeah, it was just kind of crazy, but we finished our walk and headed back home and then we just kind of ended the night. So I just wanted to pick it back up here. Porter has been kind of fussy lately and I don't know if that's just like a normal infant thing or if he's having some issues. I don't know, but it seems like whenever he's awake, he's crying and unhappy and it doesn't matter if I'm holding him. Like he constantly is acting like he wants to feed and then I feed him and then he only wants a little bit and then he gets mad, like it hurts his stomach. And I try to burp him and sometimes I get burps out and sometimes I don't and I have gas drops, I've given those to him. And so I just don't understand like what the problem is. And I'll say, Porter, what's your problem? And so now Grace always says, what's your problem? <laughs> So, I don't know. He's supposed to be the chill baby. I can't have another crazy demanding baby like Grayson is. So, 
We've been just kind of dealing with that, but hopefully it gets better. What do you have to say? Huh? So I ordered this outfit from Amazon and it looks really cute. And I'm actually really disappointed in it. I don't even remember what the brand is. Um, but it's just like really cheaply made. The one foot, um, it's hard to focus on, but like here, it had like a bunch. I actually already cut a bunch of it off, but it must have come off more in the wash. Just like had a bunch of threads loose that I've had to keep cutting. And then one of the, oh, it's down here. One of the um, buttons doesn't have a match. So I'm actually just not impressed with this. I thought it looked really cute online and then I was just really not impressed with it. So if you find this on Amazon, I don't really, ask me in the comments below if you really care, but, and I can look it up on my Amazon account, but I was actually really not impressed with this. But I ordered it like forever ago before Porter was even born, so I can't even really return it. So we're just kind of stuck with it, which I mean, like he doesn't care, but I'm just not impressed. What is that? Mmm. Mm. Watermelon. watermelon. So I got out this bowl. It's got honeydew melon and watermelon in it. And Grayson has taken all of the honeydew melon out because he does not like it so that he can reach the watermelon. It's not enough to just pick around it. No, he took it out and put it on the table because he doesn't like it. <laughs> We're out here enjoying the beautiful weather. It's like 70. Anthony's here working. Felix is jealous. And Porter is enjoying the weather too. He's snoozing away. <laughs> We're just hanging out. <laughs> so beautiful out today. Sunny and 70. Tomorrow's supposed to be even warmer. Gonna go get more watermelon? <laughs>